Next one's from Fall Vampire, and the subject is Soraya problems in AEW. I don't know if you guys follow her on Twitter or not, but since Wednesday, 28th of September, the artist formerly known as Paige has been locked into a Twitter battle with a whole bunch of wrestling marks. Basically, her debut promo in AEW has rightfully been buried by the fans, and Soraya is not happy about it. She's doing all the usual lines. You're losers. Leave the house once in a while. I don't care what you think, etc. I'm writing to ask, though, could she could she have seen this coming? It's hardly a secret that AEW fans are the single most toxic, harassing no life pieces of shit out there. So how come she thought that she was going to be welcomed with open arms? Plus, considering that she's supposed to be AW's new big baby face signing, again, sorry, Tony, Ember Moon, and Ruby Riot for the women's division. Isn't that a total car crash of way to get over with the fans? I hate to say it, but if you can see her run AEW being a huge batch of nothing. Uh, um, I, I mean, if, if she can't wrestle, it's a huge nothing burger. For one, if she can wrestle and wins a championship, at least they have a, a popular figure that's like more mainstream they can like maybe draw more attention to the women's division but bro they they got a lot of they they have they have they, that division needs a makeover meaning all the girls in that division need a makeover they're coming on tv dressed like slobs or look, look like they're broke uh, they look like you know they, they look like they're they, they dress for shopping at the mall or something like that you know they just the, the, the problem with that division is when the women come out they're not presented like superstars like they are in the wwe and like the, it just looks like night and day and like amateur versus pro with when, when, when the women on that show come on TV as opposed to the WWE. And that's why the WWE women do numbers and the AEW women don't. I think it's kind of obvious. You know, what do you think, Conan? Well, let me preface this by saying I've met Paige many times, uh, especially when she was at ADR. It's very sweet, very cool. We were, and I think I mentioned this before. We we're going to use it in Triple Mania 30. Or as Conroy would say, trip. What did they say? Tripla. 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 Right. Uh, here's the problem. She got a massive ovation when she came out, and I think she lulled herself into a false sense of "I can do no wrong, bro." But it's happened to Ronda and a lot of others. That was a very long and not a good segment. You can't expect everyone to like what you do all the time. If it was good, she wouldn't be getting all that shade. And you got to learn in wrestling just in life to take the good with the bad. And you're not going to win against these trolls. So you calling them like that, all you're doing is whooping up a hornet's <clears throat> nest. And I just think that a lot of people supported her through her past ordeals. But, dude, in this climate, you get no passes for subpar promos and matches. And that's just the way it is. That's true. 